there are plenty of men out there that I know personally who married Filipinas who had children before they got they met. And they those kids love them to death. And they've adopted them and become dad to those kids. And I'll tell you right now, how is that any different than meeting a woman here in the US that has a child from a previous marriage? Uh, chances are these women already have kids. The baby daddy took off and now she's going to have someone to take care of the kids and probably her family. Yes, a lot of the women do have children in the Philippines. That, that is correct. Also, a lot of the women they are going to meet here in the U.S. have children as well from previous baby daddies who took off. So what's the difference? I, I, I fail to see the point of your comment, Will. That's, that's no different. Women who get involved with someone, if they get pregnant, okay. they got, Now they have a child. Are you determining that you can't be with someone who has a child because you don't want to take care of their child? That's fine. That's, that's your prerogative. There are plenty of men out there that I know personally who married Filipinas who had children before they got they met. And they those kids love them to death. And they've adopted them and become dad to those kids. And I'll tell you right now, how is that any different than meeting a woman here in the U.S. that has a child from a previous marriage? Where's the difference? You're condemning a Filipina because she had a relationship with someone and wound up being pregnant and chose to keep her child. You're condemning her for something that's commonplace here in the U.S. Remember, dude, this is realville, not fantasy land. You're not going to make a statement like that, and I'm not going to tear it apart because your statement is basically saying, oh, because she had a relationship and a child that you can't, there's something wrong with her. That's not correct. That's a mind, the state of mind that you have, my friend that you need to deal with because a woman with a child is nothing to be you know, shy of. Women with children work harder than women who don't have children because they have a responsibility to take care of that little one. Why would you condemn that or pass up a good woman just because she has a child? You might love that child just as much as you would love a biological child of your own. So what's the difference between a girl in the Philippines with a kid and a girl in America that has a kid? Don't exclude women because they had a chilled child or, you know, they had a previous relationship. You, why would you exclude them for any reason? They're good people still. Just because they have a kid doesn't mean she's not a good person or a good woman or potentially an amazing wife. Um, you know, I've dated plenty of women that had kids. Didn't work out with them for one reason or another, but it wasn't an immediate I can't date you because you have a child. I mean, I'd give any woman a chance that I think is, you know, cool and I find attractive and, you know, I, I, there's no reason to exclude a group for, for any particular reason. And it's the same thing with the women there. They're not going to exclude you because you have children. So if you have children, you made poor choices in the past with your dating, uh, previous dating uh, adventures. You have children. You're not married anymore. So why would you want a woman to exclude you because you have kids? Don't exclude them because they're not going to exclude you. find thousands of stunning, sincere, single women serious about finding love and the perfect man for them. Join men from all over the world as they take a trip and find their future brides. Interested? Check out our website at manila-women.com. Don't forget to
to click on our red subscribe button and notice bell to get updated every time we add something new. Oh, 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 oh,